Hey, let's talk about an alternate approach to creating wealth. Hey guys, what's up? Randy Gage here. I want to welcome you to another episode of Prosperity TV. Big shout out to you guys listening on the podcast. I'm coming to you live and in color, live and in color from Lake Monona, which is actually in my hometown of Madison, Wisconsin. I'm here, uh, came home to visit my mother for her birthday. So maybe get a little panorama if uh, Madison is famous for being in four lakes. Uh, this is one of the four big lakes here. And I have my niece, Allie, who is my camera woman today. Uh, so I want to talk about something you see a lot. If you ever read these, how to get rich, how to retire early, how to retire young and early, how to get rich early. They're all talking about, uh, to me, this kind of a trope. It's like everybody's talking about Starbucks, you know. If you have a Starbucks latte every day times 365 days a year, if you go out to eat at Red Lobster twice a week, and if you cooked at home instead, and everybody goes with this clip the coupon approach. And I'm not a big believer in that. The approach you see so much is how to cut expenses, how to slack expenses, how to get coupons and discounts and bargains and negotiate. And you notice I never talking about that on Prosperity TV because there's only a finite amount of stuff you can cut. Okay, once you get to the bones, you're at the bones. And then what kind of life do you have? If whereas if you go the other way, which is what I'm talking about, is how do I increase my income? How do I create more value? Remember, money is just a its just a method of exchange. You do not get rich by uh, acquiring wealth. Money doesn't mean anything. The way you get wealthy is you acquire wealth. Now, what is wealth? Wealth would be a business that produces an income. It could be a factory, an automated factory that manufactures things. Uh, it could be a restaurant, it could be, but anything that, uh, an entity that produces more income because that gives you more money, which you can then invest and get more wealth, right? You want, you, you want to wake up tomorrow wealthier than when you went to sleep tonight. So that isn't about acquiring money, that's about creating wealth. And so you say, how do I do that? You say, I, how do I create more value in the world? How do I provide more service to the world? Because when you create value, when you provide service, when you solve problems, people will exchange money for you to make those problems go away, and then you can use that money to create more wealth. And that's the approach I think you ought to take. So let me know what you think. Get down in the comments if you're watching this on YouTube. Uh, if you're listening on the podcast, hit me up on Twitter. Go out there, have an amazing day, guys. Peace.